In the center of Des Moines, this building was constructed roughly 1930, and this is a very unique facility. It's a school for special needs children with some very unique architecture that uh, kind of proposed a lot of challenges from a renovation standpoint for a heating and cooling system. You know, with the architecture of this building and it's on the historical registry, you know, we needed to look for a solution that wasn't very evasive into the spaces. The way we're exchanging and absorbing and rejecting heat is through uh, water. We've got a central plant located in the adjacent school with a cooling tower and a boiler. Brings it over to the building and then we've got water-cooled condensing units that sit in the basement. The water-cooled condensing units are piped up to different areas and zones. The refrigerant lines allow us to run the smaller piping in locations where you just couldn't run hydronic piping or chilled water piping. VRF lends itself very well to a retrofit application because there's lots of flexibility in how the system 